So Connor Lamb isn't going to support Pelosi. Connor Lamb, citing need for new leadership, will not support Nancy Pelosi as Democratic leader. Connor Lamb, the Democrat running to replace Tim Murphy, uh, said that if elected, he would like to see House Democrats replace Nancy Pelosi as, as their leader. So there you go. Uh, Paul, if you're still watching, there's a way this guy's a little bit better. He'll support Stephen Jaffe. And you know what? I know some people that are close to Connor Lamb. I'm going to encourage him to endorse Stephen Jaffe. So, yeah, there you go. He's a little bit better. Would you rather have a Democrat who is slightly more moderate on policy and will support primarying out Pelosi or a Republican who doesn't care about any of the above? Yes, there is a difference. Is it a small difference? Yes. Is it a long-term working differential? No, it's not. However, would I rather have that than Rick Saccioni? Yeah, this guy could endorse Jaffe. And I'm going to do my part to make sure that happens. So uh, there you go. Pelosi is voting Republican. I don't know what you're referring to specifically, but yeah, I believe you. Pelosi pretty much is a Republican. Pelosi, you know, we don't have two parties in this country. We have the money party. I mean, yeah, we talk about that all the time. We know that. I texted my dad this morning and I literally said, I'm glad the Republican that went to our high school beat the Republican that didn't. And it was meant as a tongue in cheek comment. Um, so yeah, at least somebody like a Connor Lamb can do stuff like this. Whereas if Rick Saccioni still sat in that seat, we wouldn't even have a chance. But again, this kind of incrementalism is not a, 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 a recipe for success. Again, if he didn't have the libertarian taking those votes away, and if he didn't have the city center, which always goes Democrat, no matter what, anyway, um, he wouldn't, he wouldn't have won. So this whole idea, you know, we need to sell populism in the heartland. That's what needs to happen. And establishment Democrats aren't interested in doing that. You know, who is interested in doing that? Uh, the progressives trying to primary them out. That's who's interested in doing that. Stephen Jaffe wants to do that. The guy who's going to primary out Pelosi. That's who's interested in doing that. So there you go. That is one thing to be a little optimistic about. And, uh, you know, I have some, I'm, I'm going to contact Connor Lamb today and I'm going to say, Hey man, you know, we don't agree on a lot, but, uh, we agree on Pelosi. So, uh, how about you make an endorsement? Hey guys, thanks for watching. That was a clip from get your news on with Ron, the world's first viewer curated streaming news show. What does that mean? That means I log on to a stream and people tweet me articles over on Twitter at Ron Placone or they use our Reddit subsection, which is just get your news on with Ron over on Reddit. And that's how we build the show. I'm seeing all these articles for the first time. We are literally getting our news on together. Follow me on Twitter at Ron Placone so you can participate. And this show streams live every Tuesday through Friday at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So please do tune in. If you want to support this show, you can do so over on patreon.com slash romplacone, where for as low as a dollar a month, you get access to exclusive podcasts every week, exclusive videos, free tickets to shows when I'm performing in your town, and more for as low as a dollar a month. Please do consider it. Thank you so much for your support. This has been Get Your News On with Ron.